I'd like to introduce our ultrasonic kit. Uh, so this is for our irrigation activation. We have five different tips available in this kit. So the first one we have is one for troughing between canals, or if there's two canals that are very close together in an isthmus, you can use this tip to open up between the isthmuses and to make sure that our irrigation penetrates deeper down. Uh, once the canals are fully prepared, then we have three tip options. Uh, so one is 18.5 millimeters. Uh, it's got a 25 tip uh, and a 2% taper. So it's very narrow, but this really needs to be used in the straight part of the canal. Uh, so this one is very well wearing um, and really resistant. Uh, so this one's actually also very useful for removal of fractured instruments because it's got a very small taper and it's strong. Uh, we have two other ones then that are a little bit more uh, fragile. One of them has a really small taper of 1%, uh, but it's got a smaller tip and it's longer, so it can get deeper down into the canal system. But again, it, you can curve these, but you need to be very careful, because if you're going to curve it and you're going to use the ultrasonic uh, power, it's going to touch the canal wall and that's going to dampen the effect. So it really is mainly to be used in the, in the straight part of the canal. Again, the smallest one we have is a 20 tip and it's got a 1% taper. Uh, so that can be really useful for removing uh, fractured instruments as well, or really accurately removing dentine in very precise treatments. Now, the last one that I want to introduce as well, it's a special tip that you can attach uh, a polymer onto it. Um, we have four different sizes of polymers. Uh, this has got a 20 tip and it's 21 millimeter length. You can use these in ultrasonic uh, activation, but actually I've been mainly using these just as dynamic irrigation rather than having to try and use a GP point around curves. Uh, you can use this uh, without any power at all. Um, now, if you have room and you feel you can use power, you need to use them on the lowest power setting. So you can't use them very high or uh, if you use them on too high a power, uh, the polymer will just start to come apart. Uh, but you can use it just as the same way as you would do for a GP pumping. Uh, so this is a really nice uh, addition to the irrigation kit as well. If you have any questions, let us know. Uh, we're going to start demoing these kits on our course in April um, and we'll do an online explanation of how to use them as well.